going from that to straight pipe V8 4Runner in today's video. But right now, we're just kind of switching around the cars so that we could weld it. For people who saw the last video where we did the lift and the wheels, um, this was the alignment that we had after doing the lift, and then this is what we got it corrected to. So, um, not like huge differences, but enough to where like the wheels don't really rub on the back fender now, but now they're more on the front bumper. So you can see like it's. We have like some um, rubber here that's kind of coming off, so I think we're going to go from this tab and find like a decent line like over here, just chip off this corner, because that's the only thing that's rubbing. And then I think from a junkyard, I'm going to try to find a different pair of back mud flaps so that I still have these I can use if I want to put them back on, because it's hard to see because of the light, but basically there's a hole here in the, the rear quarter where like you have the wide body piece and then you actually have like the body of the car and I want to like be able to cover that so when we're mudding and stuff like you don't have that exposed but then I'm going to cut the flap so then you can still see the tread from the back and that's pretty much it but now we're going to get the exhaust done we got two and a half because that's the size of the exhaust so I guess we have to cut it perfectly four feet or I think it's like 40 something inches of two and a half inch exhaust. So basically you're supposed to check like every, or after a hundred miles of like installing the lift to recheck um, the tightness of the bolts and stuff, which we haven't done. And I don't know if we're gonna do it here. I might just do that at my house at some point. I just wanna make sure everything's torqued down, especially since we weren't able to torque everything down like perfect. We just Loctited a lot. First cut. This is a fat muffler, isn't it? So we're gonna make a cut right there because as you can see it like just turns like right after the muffler and then it's pretty straight on the front side so. I wanna cut it right here but then I have this plate in the way. But like right here is like perfectly leveled with this back half I believe. Yeah. But I'm sure I could bend it somehow to reach up here so I'll probably end up just slicing it right here. Dang, we're already like getting <laughs> there. It's done. Done is done. Ain't <laughs> no going back now, bro. <laughs> cut pretty good. Yeah, it was a good cut. So I got See how this quick one. I got that bitch off, man? Yeah, well, once I switched it, I got my shit off immediately. <sighs> Weed stuff, Allah. Come on. So now we just have to connect this to that. To that. It's a probably a good three foot piece. You should search your car out. Should I? Yeah, I'm so nervous right now. I'm so nervous, dude. Oh, my God. Alright, do some reps. Oh, it sounds good. Not that loud. No, it's not loud at all. That's not even loud. Dude, that sounded so dude, good. Dude, that's perfect. That is that literally perfect. So oh my gosh, dude. 
But dude, it sounds so good. <laughs> it's going to be a little bit quiet. It's going to just be a little bit quieter than. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Dude, it's not even loud. Dude, I kind of want to remove your resonators now. I know. I feel like under load though, the thing's going to be like sounding nice. <laughs> well, actually, I want to show you guys the header real quick. Right, <laughs> it's so choked up. Look at that. That's the exhaust pipe. That's terrible. I need to at some point invest in some new headers and like an exhaust system that'll just like clear that up like so much more. But as of now, this is gonna be perfect. I'll catch you guys uh, when we actually start welding it. And uh, yeah. It's gonna come this way, turn it back, mm -hmm. and then have it come up and then over. Because of how the inlet and outlet sit different. I'm over here figuring out what part of the bumper to cut so that the wheel doesn't hit. Um, so basically, this is that tab. I just have it going from here to this body line right here. I just taped it. I'm just going to use an X-Acto blade or a little knife and just trace it. And then um, just keep tracing until it's gone because it's not that thick. But it's going to flow nice with this tab with the body line, so it shouldn't be too bad. And then we'll just touch up paint on the inside and be all good. So here we are. I just finished cutting uh, this part. And it actually flows really nice. Probably going to touch it up with some paint. We should have plenty of clearance right here. And it shouldn't look too bad. So I'm going to go ahead and take off the paint right or the tape right here. It's not too bad. <laughs> It actually flows pretty nicely. Doesn't look too out of place. Now it's time to rotate it on the other side and we should be good. When you look at it from in here, it looks like it was meant to be as if not even cut. Really happy with how it came out. Too loud. Watch 
You gotta, you gotta stand out here and listen to this. Okay. Are we gonna piss him off? Nah. Okay. Holy cow, that sounds so good. Hey, that's my bad. We're, we just finished doing uh, an exhaust on my car. So we're just seeing what it sounded like. Uh, he does. All right. Okay. All right, we'll leave. Okay, I'll tell him right now. I tried to wave him down just now, so. Uh, I, I don't know the exact address, but it's down the block. Okay. Stop. Hey, you gotta get out of here, man. What are you doing? All right, dude, we're just. We built the car, we're just going out. Oh, fuck out of here. Pay a lot of money for this house. I got a little kid. <laughs> Screw his ass. Oh, He's like, yeah, you need to get the fuck out of here. Um, I was like, yeah, I tried to wave him down because I saw you were le like coming out of your house. And he's like, yeah, just like, you know, I have a kid here and I pay like a lot of money for this house. So I'm trying to, you know, just try and enjoy it. I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry. We're just, we just finished doing the exhaust on it. And he's like, yeah, you seriously need to get the fuck out of here. I'm like, you should have told me to fuck off. <laughs> we would have kicked his ass. Yeah, we if he tried to do something, he's like, "Yeah, like if you don't get the fuck out of here now, I'm gonna call the cops." Like, I'm like, "All right, <laughs> I'm, I'm not know. worried about it." <laughs> at all. all right, Mr. Police man. Yeah. <laughs> So you can see that whole, uh, let's see, zoom in real quick. That hole right there. And we had to drill that in the fender, sadly, cause uh, that was it. the only way we were able to like get that back bolt cause we were starting to strip it, which those are so difficult and I know there's more ways to do it, but <laughs> that's how we ended up doing it.